Today's video from Sam Forest Help. We're going to demonstrate how to set up journal paper printing on the ER180U. Um, so as standard, the register operates in receipt mode, meaning that when you process a transaction, you get a receipt print out the front and you don't get an audit roll, an audit copy of the transaction. If you don't want a receipt printing with every transaction, you can press receipt on off and then that stops the receipt automatically printing but gives you the option to print the receipt on request. However, you can also set the till to work in the journal mode printing so that instead of issuing a customer receipt or giving you the option for a customer receipt, you can have the paper an audit roll so it's a copy of every transaction uh, that feeds onto the spool and stays in the machine. So in this video I'm going to demonstrate how you set that up. Once I've got rid of the paper on this spool, pop that back into place for now. So the first thing you need to do is to go into the program mode by pressing 6 and then mode. The P indicates program mode and then to set up the journal printing it's free zero, followed by subtotal, followed by six, then the X time key, and then one, subtotal. The spool moves straight away to indicate that you've done it correctly, and then it's cache to save, and then we can now return to the reg mode. REG. So in the reg mode, we can, if we press the feed button, we can see that the paper's feeding on and the spool's turning round. So all we need to do now is to put the paper on. So I like to feed, or I like to fold the edge of the paper so you get a nice thick edge. Just makes it a bit easier to locate into the slot. So you're basically aiming for that slot on the central spindle of the spool. You pop it in there. And then as you drop the spool back in place, tightly wind the paper around the central spindle. Check you've done it correctly by pressing feed. What you're looking for is the paper being taken up and not spooling round so you can tell it hasn't come loose. Then pop the cover back on and the two will now work. Sales are exactly the same, you just don't get the um, receipt print out. Okay, I hope that video has been helpful. We've got plenty more videos showing you how to get the best out of the uh, ER180. Um, some of those will be appearing on screen now so you can check those out. You can also subscribe to this YouTube channel or visit samforeshelp.co.uk for more. So it's just you can see the spool is moving on because I've got the receipt switched off it didn't actually record the transaction but there we go we're selling that one with the receipt on. It's all recorded on there and even when you do your end of day read or your standard read that's also recorded on the journal roll. Thanks.